Oh, welcome back to another TV Royale Best of Legendary Arena. Another hype replay. I love watching TV Royale because they have the best replays. Super fun to watch. This one has over 18,000 views. These are big names, over 7,400 trophies each. Now, let's introduce your blue player. His name, Archer Master. And his opponent in the top red. It's Ay Ay! <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. His name is AE. No, his name is Ay! <laughs> That's how I read that. I don't care about anybody else or how they read it. We got a big poison on top of this Exmo here. That's right. Archer Master is an Exmo Master. But I always found it weird that he'd be the Archer Master without the Archer Queen. What kind of Master does not have an Archer Queen in his deck? You tell me. Is that even a thing? I don't think it is. So, Archer Master, or should I just call him Archer because he's not a Master without a Queen? I don't care what anybody says. I'm going to call him Archer. As I take a sip of my coffee, we are 1 minute 30 seconds left. <sighs> Which, as you guys know, means that anything can happen. We got a big Skeleton King on defense here against this Barbarian Barrel. Uh, sorry, with the Barbarian Barrel. Should handle that Expo no problem. But the Expo did connect and do quite a bit of damage against IE's tower there on the left side. Archer is going to feel very good about that. Patting himself on the back. Probably even going to call his mother. Let her know that he is kicking butt right now. On defense. I has to handle this expo. He only realistically has a Skeleton King and an, an Ice Wizard. Well, he also has the Graveyard. Uh, sorry, not the Graveyard. The Tombstone. Well, he has the Graveyard, but he has the Tombstone for defense. So if he can, you know, just rotate that tombstone with the ice wizard, he should be, nah, he should be fine. He should be fine. Aye, with 30 seconds left on the clock, still has to defend his left side tower, still has to make some damage happen at the same time. This, this expo for Archer is just doing so good. It's just so good. Just because IE doesn't really have a, def a, de a deck that can defend against it. Like, he doesn't have, you know, he doesn't really have, I mean, he has the poison, but he doesn't have tanky units that could absorb it. Like, look, he's going to have to lose half the HP on that Skeleton King, and that just really sucks. Look, it's gone. Like, his Skeleton King might as well be dead. Might as well be dead. At this point in the game, guys, we are... 20 seconds in overtime. It's double elixir. The next tower to go down. It's gonna be GG. I is from the future, as you can tell by his uh, his clan name. There, he's from the he's from the next year. So only he knows realistically if he wins this game. But you and I are gonna have to find out together. <laughs> this expo put on the right side by Archer. I think Archer wants a ye. <laughs> to, uh, to overplay perhaps on that right side although it's kind of funny he did more damage to that right side tower and that's gonna put him at a significant advantage you know I always said why don't expo users like switch sides like it just makes sense to split the DPS like that right now though Archer Master has to deal with this attack on the left side while he's set up for the right side his expo though is really well set up there's even a Tesla tower this time he should be able to lock onto that tower, and if he does, it's going to be GG. Even though IE did make a small comeback on that left side tower, he is three, literally 3 HP behind. Oh my god, that poison. Going to bring him back. Archer has to really start rotating fireballs, or he is going to lose this game. He needs to start rotating fireballs and logs. It's too late to keep setting up an expo, bro. What are you doing? What are you doing? There's one fireball, but it's not going to be enough. Ie has his own poison. Poison does more damage. And oh my god, is this going to be a loss here from Archer? Did Archer just botch his defense? I think he just botched his defense. No, that fireball is not going to be enough, bro. Gee. No way. What a comeback from Ie. Wow. Wow. Never give up. 
never surrender. I ain't gonna take this game against Archer, who... I don't know, man. I think he lost the plot after about the... With one minute left in triple extra overtime, I think he just... I don't know. He, he kind of went all in on that right side tower. Not exactly the right move to make. Anyways, guys. GG. I'm your host, B-U-Z-Z Buzz. And I will see you in the next replay.